right, everybody, welcome to another episode of Train with Dr. Wu. We're going to continue with our post-ACL RTP. Today we're going to do lateral shuffles. Now, this is super, super, super important because we need to teach our athletes how to de-accelerate, all right? There's acceleration drills and there's de-acceleration drills. Understanding how to de-accelerate is very, very important and it helps, again, increase the capacity of the tissue, especially in the knee, since we are talking about ACL tears. All right, so what are some of the main things that we really want to focus on? Well, we want to focus on center of gravity, we want to focus on alignment, and we want to make sure that we're in a proper position when we decelerate. We're isolating this movement, so it's very important to be very detailed when we do this because if we aren't detailed now, it's just going to be really, really ugly down the line. So. What you're gonna do is you're gonna get two cones, put them on a straight line, and put them about 20 meters apart. And we, as you can see, we've already done that already here. Now, the thing that we want to focus on is our center of gravity, all right? So, our center of gravity is around our umbilical cord in our belly buttons, so like right around here. What we wanna do is we wanna start at cone A, and we're gonna go to cone B. You're going to side shuffle like this, and then we're going to stop at this cone. Now, when we stop at this cone, what we want to see is that your hips are still in the center, your knee is outside of your big toe, right? My big toe is right here, our knee is going to come in here, everything's going to shift this way, and we're going to push off like so, like that, right? So now what I would say is the first thing that we want to drill is just having them to come to a complete stop, hold there for a second, and then push off. Stop for a second, and then push off. Stop for a second, and push off. Now you can continue to do that, make sure that they stop. When they stop, you're looking for that alignment, right? You're looking for that center of gravity to be low, the knee on the outside, and your, your torso very, very, very stable. As you get more comfortable with it and you feel like the athlete understands what's going on, you increase the speed, you increase the length. You can also add in some dribbling. You can put a ball in there. But this is a very, very important drill. I would continue to do this, progress them into it. If you guys have any questions, please don't hesitate to give us a call. Our contact information is right below and move free humans.